The magic of the plant cell. Cells are the basic unit of structure and organization of all living things, and in our case, the plant. The plant cell contains various organelles that allow the specialization and functions within a cell. Here are some of the exciting organelles we will learn about today. The plant cell has two barriers, the cell wall, and the cell membrane. The cell wall serves as protection and gives the cell its rigid shape. The cell membrane acts as a barrier that controls the movement of various substances. Cytoplasm is a semi-fluid material that fills each cell and is enclosed by the cell membrane. The chloroplasts of the plant cell contain chlorophyll, and it is where photosynthesis takes place. The mitochondrium is the powerhouse of the cell. What this means is that the mitochondrium converts fuel particles, mainly sugars, into usable energy. The nucleus is the control center of the cell. It contains coded directions for the production of proteins and cell division. The nucleus is the CEO of the cell. The nuclear membrane is the membrane that surrounds the nucleus. It has nuclear pores that allow larger substances to move in and out of the nucleus. Like a lady of the night. Golgi bodies is a flattened stack of membranes that modifies, sorts and packages proteins into sacs called vesicles. Endoplasmic reticulum is the membrane system of folded sacs and connected channels for protein and lipid production. Inside the nucleus is the nucleolus. The nucleolus is the site of ribosome production. The vacuole is a large sac used to temporarily store food, enzymes, and other materials needed by the cell. Sometimes it even stores waste products. The ribosome is an organelle that helps produce proteins. With all of these parts working together, they create the plant cell.